What's up YouTube and Royal Army? Welcome back to another video by me, Future Prince. And today we have a very special opening for you guys. Today I'm finally cracking into this Elite Trainer Box. This Generations. I like it. It's very awesome. I'll show you the back. And I'll just take everything out. I'll put it a little bit Right, I'll put it like that, and then you can view it if you want. You can, I'm sure you know what it comes with, but for those who don't, I'll open it up and then tell you what's on the inside. I'll take everything out. So let's just use our key just to open that up there. Plastic wrap wasn't too hard to get off, it doesn't seem. All right, so. As I'm sure you guys have seen before, I'll show you some. I'll show you this. If you go like this, and you take like this thing off, if you like take go and go like that, you can see like all the um you know there's Pikachu, Venusaur, Charizard, and then there's Blastoise, and it's really cool because you can like hang it on your wall. As you can see, I have some there. If the camera is shaky, I'll fix it after. But that's what I do with mine. I hang them up. I'll probably end up hanging this one up later. But I'm going to just put that aside for now. I'll throw it right there on my bed. And then I'll show you this. Of course, every Elite Trainer box comes with a player's guide. This one is really, really cool. I like this. I like how they did the 20 logo with all the different Pokemon on it. And, you know, it has strategies. Here's some of the cards that you can get. You know, you have the Radiant Collection. And you have all the different cards that you can get. And there's all the mythical Pokemon. I won't get too much into that. Just because of time. And I'm sure you want to see these packs open. So... I'm just going to throw the plastic to the side. I never keep that. Um, we'll take it out. I'm going to take these two little plastic dividers out. I do end up keeping the boxes. Just because I eventually I'm going to use them for storage. But of course, as you know, you get... And in this box, you get 10 packs in instead of 8. It's a little more money. I got mine for about $43.00. Which is pretty cheap. I had a discount. But you get 10 packs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 8, 9, 10. Oops, sorry about the camera, guys. And of course, you get this Shaman EX. I'm not going to take it out of the plastic wrap. Just because it's kind of a special card. Oh, mine was a little, little bit warped. But that's alright. It's not going to come out of the package anyway. And it comes with these really nice energy cards. I do like the Generations energy cards. And you get five of each. So you get about 45 or so. And of course you get these really cool dividers. You know, they're matted. You know, there's the front and there's the back. They're very nice. I'm going to see what else comes in this. Here's a code card. For the Generations Elite Trainer Box. You get that. I'm going to... There you go. Just for watching. And of course, you get these um, dice. Here's the um, coin flip die there. The big one. And then this is just like damage counters. They use them as damage counters. Some people use the older ones. But... Then you have your poison marker there, and the di and then there's the burn marker. No one really uses the burn marker, really, because burn isn't really a big thing in the TCG right now. But, that's alright. What we'll do now is I'm going to set everything that doesn't, that I won't need. And I'm going to set that all aside, and we'll, then we'll get into these packs. So, 
And the good thing I like about this is now I have sleeves for my generation set, which is really cool. I've been needing that for a long time. But let's just get into these packs. I'm just going to open up this sleeve. I'm going to open that up and just use these sleeves for any good cards that we end up getting in in this um in this elite trainer box of course so let's just put them right there and then we'll get into these packs i'll just do it as is we won't do it in any any special order we'll just do it as they came in the box so we have this venusaur pack first let's see what we can get from this and i don't need anything from gen um the radiant collection because i completed it what i'm mainly trying to get in this is like Jolteon and anything else that I really need. Like, I think I need Mega Blastoise or, or one of them. So the card trick, if you didn't know, is three and three. And I already see something already. I we'll have a Krabby. We have a Ghastly. We have a Meowth. We have a Slowpoke, and that's originally from the Fossil set. We have a Swablu. We have a Cloyster. A Mr. Mime. We have a Ghastly Reverse Hollow, and that's just a common. And wow, a Pikachu Full Art. Very nice. And then a Meowstic EX. Meowstic has the moves Shadow Ear and Mind Shock, and Pikachu had Nuzzle and Quick Attack. So I'll set those aside. I'm going to put them in sleeves. And then I'll show you in the recap what we do end up getting. It should be a pretty good recap, judging from what we got from uh, already. Only one pack in, and we got a pretty um, a pretty good amount of cards that were good. So let's hope we can continue with that luck and get something else that's awesome. Oh, kind of hard to open there. Does that mean that there's something good inside? Let's find out. No code cards, obviously, because I don't know why, but that's all right. We have a Ghastly, and look at that, a, a Psychic Energy right after. I'm going to move my camera a little bit because I kind of keep bumping it. We have a Krabby. We have a Geodude. We have a Floral Crown. An Evo Soda. A Pokemon Center Lady. Oh, a Reverse Hollow Rare, a Jinx, not one of my favorite Pokemon, but a Reverse Hollow Rare is always nice to get. We have, and it has the moves Victory Kiss, and the ability Victory Kiss, and the move Hug. And then we have Meowstick for our second Radiant Collection card, and then the Rare is a Jinx. Okay. So, not the greatest of packs, but two Rares is always good, always decent to get from a pack, can't complain. We did get two full, we did get two EXs. I mean not EXs, two ultra rares from the first pack, so can't expect all the packs to be good. But we have oh I see something already. We have a Tangela, we have a Zubat, a Geodude, a Dark Energy, we have a Gulpin for our first Radiant Collection card, then there's a Shauna. A Pokemon fan club. The reverse holo is a Pikachu, which is a common. We have a Charizard, which is just an uncommon, and that's a Radiant Collection card, the second one, and oh my god. A Blastoise EX with Hyper Whirlpool and Hydro Press. A very nice pull to get, guys. Blastoise is one of my favorite water types. Probably my favorite starter um, final evolution. Just because I like turtles a lot and just he's powerful and things like that. But let's see what we can get in this next pack. Alright, so hopefully we can get a few cards that we need. We have a Magikarp, a Fairy Energy, we have a Doduo. As well as a Tangela, a Fletchling, a Machoke, we have a Clefable, 
a Magmar with very cool artwork. Ooh, and an Altaria, which is our second Radiant Collection, and a Hitmonlee with Stretch Kick and Spiral Kick. So, not the not the best pack there, but that's all right. We've gotten three Ultra Rares so far, so that's not too bad. What we'll do is we'll open up this next one, which is a Pikachu pack. Very cool. So let's see. So three and three. <laughs> so we have um, Slowpoke, a Magmar, a Ghastly, a Fire Energy, a Charmander, an Olympia. We have an energy switch. We have a Krabby. A Gardevoir EX Full Art. That one's cool. It has Life Leap and Shining Wind. With three of all the evolutions. And then a Dodrio Rare. Don't do it. You're messing with the lightning. Mm. Can I open one? <laughs> So let's open up the next one. That was a Blastoise pack. So let's just take three and three. So pretty good so far. Four ultra rares. We have a Paris. We have a Caterpie. A Clefairy. We have a Ponyta. We have a Raichu. A Clement. We have a Team Flare Grunt. The Reverse Hollow is a Diglett, which is just a common. We have a Slurpuff, eating all those pancakes, and then a Snorlax. How weird is that, that we get a Slurpuff eating pancakes, and then go on to a Snorlax, which likes to eat almost everything. But I like Snorlax, not making fun of him. He's really cool. I remember that one episode where they couldn't wake up Snorlax and then they had to get the guy to play the flute. That was a really funny episode. And then we have a Lightning Energy. We have a Doduo. We have a Shelter. A Metal Energy. We have a Swablu. A Red Card. A Revitalizer. Oh, nice. A Fairy Energy Reverse Hollow. Very cool. Very nice. And then we have a Jirachi for a second Radiant Collection card. Very nice. And the rare is a Pinsir. So not too bad. I do like those reverse energies. Those are very cool. The, I wish they made all energies like that. You know what ones I like too? I like the um energies from the Heart Gold Soul Silver set. Those were actually very cool. I know the, um, I think the Psychic one had Espeon, and then the Fighting one had, um, like, Sudo Wudo. So we have a Pikachu, we have a Zubat, we also have a Metal Energy, a Magmar, a Wobbuffet, a Revitalizer, a Metapod, a Clefable, oh nice, a Sylveon EX with Dress Up and Precious Ribbon. A very nice pull, guys. So, so far we have five, and the rare was a Hitmonchan with Bullet Punch and Mock Cross. So we have five Ultra Rares. Oh, look at that, two Pikachu packs to finish it off. All right, so second to last pack here, guys. Getting down there on chances to get any ultra rares or anything. Either way, I'm satisfied. Very good elite trainer box overall. I can't complain. So, oh, when I see something else, we have a Doe Duo, a Shelter, a Metal Energy, a Slowpoke, a Snow Run. We have a Pokeball trainer card. Then we have a Graveler. The Reverse Hollow is a Machop, which is a common card. We have an Eveltal Radiant Collection card, and oh my god, it's a Golem EX. 
Wow, that's awesome. So we have six ultra rares from this out of out of nine packs so far. So let's see if this 10th pack can hold anything in it. If it doesn't, I'll be happy either way. A very good opening overall. So do the card trick. Last pack here. We have a Krabby. I see something else. We have a Caterpie. We have a Meowth. A Rhyhorn. We have a Shroomish. We have a Machoke. A Persian. The reverse is another Machop. Com just a common. A Flareon EX Full Art. Very nice. A very good pull, so that makes seven ultra rares. And the last rare is a Rapidash, non hollow. So, a very, very good, very good opening, guys. And very quickly, I'm gonna show you what we got. We have a Flareon, we have a Golem, a Sylveon, a Gardevoir, a Pikachu, a Blastoise EX, and a Meowstic EX. So very, very awesome. Can I think if you know how to do special effects in these videos? I and um, I wanted to ask you guys a question of the day. I'm sorry, my camera stopped recording. Um, the question of the day is going to be this. What is your favorite Radiant Collection card? Let me know in the comment section below what your favorite Radiant Collection card is. And let me know what you guys got from your Elite Trainer box gener from Generations. I'm, I'm, I'm very willing to know. I want to know what you guys are getting. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure to please do that. Because it really helps get the content out there. It helps, you know, I can get out there. And I wanted to tell you guys, I wanted to make an announcement. When I get to 100 subscribers, I'm going to do um, a giveaway. So this is kind of like a giveaway announcement. I know I'm far away from there. When I hit 50, I'll probably do something a little like special. Not like a giveaway, but I'll do like a special video for you guys. And um, also, if you if you like this video, please make sure... To leave a like because it's greatly appreciated and it lets me know that you want to see more of these videos and I'm willing to do it because you guys have have shown good support for me you know commenting on the videos liking the videos I do appreciate it very much and also if you if you really are interested and you want your friends to view this video Make sure to share it with them or even your family or whoever you want to share it with on social media, whatever you want to share it. You can do that. And um, I wanted to thank you, Royal Army, and YouTube for watching and have a good one.